Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Melanie and I'm so excited to be here with you today. First of all, I am in a new filming location. I'm on my bed because I was too lazy to clear off my desk to film. So here we are. And today is very exciting because I'll be opening up a mystery box from Kika Goods. Now this particular mystery box is called a lovely one. I assume because there are some more cute and lovely um, type figurines in here. Well, I should say there's mystery boxes in here, so it's a double mystery. I don't know which mystery boxes will be in here, and obviously I don't know what figurines will be on inside as well. Before we get started, I would just like to say how beautiful is this box. Now this is just the packaging it came in, and it's really, really cute. It's got all the different astrology signs around here. Um, I'm a Taurus. I was born on May 18th, so I love this. I will definitely be using this in the future, probably to give a gift to somebody who does like astrology. I think this is a really cute, a cute box for them to give to us. Now, I don't really care which mystery boxes I get in here. However, it would be really nice to get Emma, the Emma series. They're very, very cute, and I've, I haven't opened one before, and I was thinking about purchasing one from Kika Goods, but I decided not to. So I'm hoping there's one in here. I would also really like the Moon Vera series. Um, I'd be happy really with anything. So yeah, without further ado, let's unbox. So I will just take this off. Oh my gosh, how exciting. So here are the four boxes we've gotten. The first thing that catches my eye is the Nancy series right here. I am a big fan of Nancy. Um, I do have a few boxes to open, so that's really exciting. And here is the Nancy. This is the one that really catches my eye. It's very exciting. Oh, it's very, very cute. It seems to be more traditional um, sort of Chinese theme, which Nancy tends to do a lot of, of course, because it is from a Chinese company. Um, but yeah, very beautiful. This blue one is very simple, but very cute. And these two on the bottom, they're special. I like those a lot. We also got this one. Now, I've never seen this one before. It's called Eula, and it seems to be a sheep on the front by Row Life. So it's the same um, company that does Nancy. And this is really cute. So it's got a bunch of different ones. Seems to be uh, farm themed. And this one I have never even heard of. And it also, there is no English on it. So I actually have no idea what this is going to be. But I guess they look like monkeys a little bit. Although I'm not sure because these ones look like dragons. I'm not sure. That's probably a bird. Are they all birds? Oh, I'm really not sure. <laughs> They've got bird feet, but the ears look like they might be cats or foxes or something. And some of them kind of look like monkeys. So I don't really know, but this looks exciting. Something I wouldn't have picked up for myself, that's for sure. And then the last one is Froyo Career Cities by Toy City. Now this looks like a bunch of dogs. Oh, that's so cute. I have a dog. Uh, he's a Pomeranian. His name is Sim Sim. Um, although these are not Pomeranians, of course, but there's some really cute ones. Okay, so let's get started with opening them. I'm most excited to open the Nancy, so I think I'll start from this side with the Froyo figurine, the Career series. Now, of all of these, I think I would want the Merchant looks pretty cute. I also like the Firefighters. Um, the Photographer is pretty cute. Honestly, any of them, they're all pretty random and pretty cute. So let's get started. And then one, two, three. Oh, that's so cute. I got the firefighter. <laughs> I'm not the good with dog breeds, but is this? Is this a pit bull? Is that what kind of a dog it is? So here is the card and the figurine. It's pretty cute. 
Now, this is a pretty interesting figure. I don't really know why the white uh, or the eyes are all white. And I won't show you to keep it PG, but underneath the dog, you can't see it's private. So interesting, not one of my favorite figures. Probably not something I'll keep in my own personal collection. Maybe I'll give it to my brother or my dad. I don't know. Um, my neighbor next door is also a firefighter, so maybe I'll give it to him. <laughs> I don't know. This was an interesting find, and it was fun to open, but not really my taste. So let's keep the theme going, and we'll go to the next one here. Now, this is the one, and I'll try to put the translation um, up on the screen. Uh, I don't even know what company it's from, so this is really interesting. And it says right here, Allie the fox, always by your side. So it seems to be a, a fox of some sort. I'm not, I'm not really sure uh, what this is supposed to be. But it does, have, it does have little bird legs. So I don't know. Anyway, let's open it up. Okay, and then one, two, three. Oh. Oh my gosh, this one is all gold. That's this is very interesting. Again, I don't know what this is supposed to be. And here are, here is the figure with the card. Pretty interesting. Now, if we take a look at the box, um, I wasn't really dying for any of these, but the pink ones would have been cute. Um, but then I think I got this one. Not really my favorite. I probably won't keep this for my own personal collection, but um, maybe I'll give it to my brother. It's, it's an interesting one. Okay, and then for the third box, we'll open up this Eula um, by Row Life. Um, as I mentioned before, it seems to be farm themed. Um, so these ones I'm pretty interested in. So this one actually is English. So we have Windmill Baby, Sunflower, Pumpkin, Tomato, Milkmaid, Bunny, Tractor, Scarecrow, Worker, Breeder, and Wolfing. And then the mystery seems to be a farmer. Now I would be interested in Pumpkin. That one is very cute. I also like Bunny. Um, tomato is pretty cute too. Or Milkmaid. Honestly, a lot of these are pretty cute. I'd be happy with really any of them but I would say my top favorite is probably pumpkin okay and then three two one <gasps> oh so cute this one I think is the sunflower and here is the card very cute Okay, so it's actually pretty unfortunate. I think mine came broken because it seems like it was supposed to be stuck down on the bottom and there is a little bit of a ding here. So I think it was supposed to be something like, like this, which would have been cute, but that's okay. That's nothing that I can't fix myself. And just to look at the figure a little bit closer. So she is very clearly a sunflower. I do love sunflowers, they're very cheery. Um, and so she's got a sunflower crown and a sunflower in her hand and she's pretty cute. Oh, and she's got little leaf wings on the back. That's adorable. Okay, and the last but not least is this Nancy series. Um, again, I will look up what the name is and I'll put it on the screen here, but unfortunately I just um, I can't read it and there's no English on here. So this one has 12 designs and a hidden edition. So, and as I mentioned earlier, definitely seems to be Chinese themed. I think my favorite is probably this one down here. I love the colors. I like the green and it looks very pretty. I also like this one down here and this blue one is, is quite pretty. I'm not really a fan of black and red. Those are not my favorite colors. So some of these uh, are not my favorite, but this one down here is really cute as well. Okay, so let's open it up. This one doesn't seem to have a tear anywhere, so I'll just have to rip into it. Okay, this one definitely seems to have a crown of some sort. I felt it right here, so I'm interested to see which one we got. Okay, now one, two, three. Oh, <laughs> of 
course I got one of the yellow, black, and red ones. Not my favorite, but she is very pretty. So here is the figurine with the card. And the back of the card is so pretty. They don't usually put such a beautiful design on the back of cards, but this one is just really stunning. So here is sort of a closer look at the figurine. Um, yeah, like I mentioned, not really my favorite, but she does look quite royal, I will say. And her hat is very interesting. And she is, I assume, sleeping, as those Nancy figurines look like they are. And she's got what I thought, what I think is a, you know, like a snot bubble. You know how they have that in anime? Where they have a little bubble in their nose? But, I mean, I could be wrong. She could be blowing up bubble gum. I'm not sure. So, here are all of the figurines I got in this lovely mystery box from Kika Goods. Now I've got to say, I'm not sure where the lovely theme went here. When I was looking at the pictures online, the figures that they showed in there were a lot different from what I see here. So I get that it's a mystery box and anything could sort of come up, but especially these two on the side, I really wouldn't call them lovely or cute or anything. I mean, somebody may disagree with me. It's totally up to personal preference. Um, and I'm not super in love with what I've received. However, I think my favorite is probably this sunflower girl right here, the um, from Eula. I think she is the cutest. She fits the theme the best, I think. And she's overall pretty adorable, and, I, and I'm, ha I'm happy with her. The Nancy was exciting to see, but like I said, not really my color palette. So overall, not super in love with it. I think, honestly, the prettiest thing about this about this entire mystery box was the box itself. I think it's really pretty and I'll be able to reuse it again, but yeah, overall it was still fun and exciting to open this up. So I don't regret it, but um, it is definitely something for me to think about in the future um, if I'm gonna purchase another mystery box from Kika Goods. So that will be the end of today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And a big shout out to everybody who has been leaving such kind comments and leaving likes and subscribing. I so appreciate it. Um, I'm doing, I'm making these videos just because I like buying figurines and I figured if I like them, maybe one other person will enjoy watching it with me. So thank you so much for the support. I really didn't expect that anyone would wanna watch me, but it's worth it even if one person does. So thank you so, so much. For my next video, I'll be opening up some cute figurines, probably some Nancy's and some bubble eggs. Those are the ones that were requested um, because people saw them in the background of my video. So I'll be opening up those next. If you're interested in that, please like, please subscribe, and I will be trying to post every week. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye-bye. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.